you will put, put into the, you know, the code room. Uh, the code room, um, actually the size can be customized, yeah, according to your kitchen, the size, and uh, um, it can be a chiller, can be a freezer, yeah. Okay, let's go. Okay, so this is the internal view of the code room. Uh, I will talk about the, the panels and the condensing unit. About the code room, um, normally uh, the outside material, we have the steel steel, we have the galvanized steel, uh, normally it's 0 0.4 to 6 millimeter. Yes, and the thickness of the uh, foam, uh, uh, we'll have a seven, 75 millimeter, 100 millimeter, 150 millimeter, and uh, 200 millimeter. Yeah, it depends on the temperature, actually. For the chiller, we normally will recommend uh, 100 millimeter to, you know, seven, 75 millimeter. And if for the freezer, you know, it's, you know, the temperature is really low, and we will make it thicker as 150 millimeter or maybe more. Yes, the foam of the density is 445 kilogram per cubic meter. Yes, that means the temperature, you know, insulation effect is really good. Okay, and... And the advantage of our design, you can see here, it's wrong, no? Yeah, you can see it's wrong, it's wrong. It's easily for the cleaning, yes. Uh, maybe we can show you here, yes, here. Yes, it's really nice for the you know, daily cleaning. Okay, let's talk about the condensing unit. It's, uh, uh, you know, you can see the size is really small, and you can see the height is, is very low. That means what? Uh, normally, we will put the shelf inside. If the shelf, we can make it taller, then we can put more food. That means we can make full use of the storage. We can put more food. And okay, and next we will talk about the you know the shelving. We have the stainless steel material. Actually, for the cold, we normally put stainless steel material or the you know the plastic one material, which which is suitable for the low temperature. Okay, and okay. The so finally, I will talk about this is the the floor, the non-slip aluminum sheet. You know, the cold room will produce the water, right? It's really wet. So you know, uh, every day the staff come into the cold room to take the food, the, the material. Yeah, it will easy to slip away. So this is uh, you know for the safety uh, problems. Okay, and. And also the, the controller system, actually we have three types. Another one is very, very small, and this one is a digital one, and this is a mechanic, mechanical uh, type. Okay, finally, this door, we have uh, different type of doors. Yeah, this is a hinge door, and we also can customize the sliding door. Okay, so uh, if you have the, you know, your kitchen is big enough, and you, you need to store uh, so much food material, then the cold room is your necessary product. Uh, if you can give us a size, we can customize for you. Okay, let's move.